presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Let's go to Eddie in Boca Raton. Hey, Eddie, what's going on? Hey, Tom, how are you, man? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? Good, good. It is a treasure to have TFNN every hour during the trading day to be there to help you, to guide you, and even to give you some peace of mind or like that, that somebody else is there with you while you're, while you're trading this crazy market, either well, up or down. Well, listen, we appreciate you growling and with us out here because we wouldn't be out here, folks, if we didn't have all you guys, gals, tigers and tigresses as clients. And, you know, the market teaches you every single day, man. Now, Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about. Whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, folks. Let's make it a great one. You are what you believe you are. Humans are powerful magicians. You have the power to make yourself what you are right now, but it's not your reasoning mind that controls your power. It's what you believe. It's a fact, man. It's a fact for me anyway. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 187, NASDAQ up 282, NAS S&P's up 45, gold. Gold contract up $11.70, trading at 1996 an ounce. We have silver up $0.06, cents, $24.43 an ounce, light sweet crude. Up 27 cents, $80.36 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year note up 11 ticks, trading 11, 111, 11. 30 year up 12 ticks at 124.08 and King Dollar. King Dollar trading down 137 at 101.636. The Euro is at 110. The Yen is at 141. The British Pound is at 128 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877. 9276648. Give us a call, folks. Wanna know what's going on in your world and the world of the SPs? Let's take a look at them. Well, we're gonna get our heads wrapped right around the futures first. We just did that update, and you can we're gonna go right to the same place and take a look at this thing. So what you have right now, you're up 45 points. And you know, bottom line is that you know, we'll see whether this thing wants to go down there, but you gotta keep in mind once again. You got another high volume low that's laying here. So pay attention to that, even coming into the close today. And if you don't hit it today, guess what? Pay attention to it on Monday, because that, that baby's gonna get hit. Actually, oh, I see what this did. Oh, hold it. Interesting, I gotta pull this up. No, what was this? Was that? I see what we just did here. No, 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 okay. Yeah, recalculate here. This is what's going on. This was coming into the opening bar, and it had lighter volume, 69,000 versus, I missed that one, versus 39. Yeah, now this doesn't have to come back. That's what's going on here. See this? That opening bar? That's what's going on. Even though it's a higher volume, that was coming into a much higher volume. Got below it, rejected it. Yeah, so that doesn't have to do it. And I suspect we're going to be the same in the NQs. One second, let's take a look at this. I don't know how I missed that, but I did. That is not cool. Okay, let's take a look at the NQs. Going to be, yeah, it's the same thing. NQs. Where are we? Right there. Yep, that's what it did. Unreal. Uh, man, that's unusual. Okay, bottom line, you, you that that bar. That even the NQs, 15,000 was coming into that opening bar of 38. So this, thing's good. this thing can stay at the highs. That's the bottom line. We go to the gold contract. We take a look at gold. What do you have with the gold contract out here? Gold came down hard yesterday and you had volume on the way down. And we didn't test it today. So that's still wide open for a test. Let me put get the volume behind this. There we go. So 
you can see that expansion. I mean, we've rolled contracts here, but you can see that was uh, 190,000 con. No, yeah, 190,000 contracts. We're going up 154. We got 190. That's that that wants to get tested again. Now the dollar is going to get really interesting here because what we have is that we came all the way up to ice, and you know, like literally. That being said, what we also had is that we had that wide-ranging bar yesterday. And, you know, the bottom line is, as our man, Mr. Larry Pesavento, say they don't come in ones, folks. So I suspect what we're going to probably do is we're going to probably go to the top of the range. Not all the way up, but the top of that range would be 103,500. You know, it busts through, the, it busts through ice. Because, you, you know, it's pushing in here today. You do have a doji, so, you know, doji is saying, hey, man, it can pull back. But I'm kind of going with the aspect that's kind of going to blow it through it. And then what, what you'd still have is that that would still be, yeah, look at that. It'd be a, a point, there would be a 7.6.4 retracement of the whole move. And that would be saying that the next time down, you wouldn't break out the lows. It's kind of how it's set up. Now, what we are going to have out here today is this. Now, that's on the that's intraday, right? On the dailies, what you're going to have is that, you know, the bottom line is that yesterday we had a high volume high. We gave it up on price. That wants to be tested. Yeah, I, I suspect what's going to probably happen. We're going to probably test it on lighter volume. And if that's what we get, then you can fire away. You know, yesterday we did 92 million shares. Yesterday it took out the 65 million. You know, I can almost say this in a small ABC up. Yeah, really can. That's interesting. Never thought about it that way. Hmm. But that's what it. That's what it has done. We'll see how. We, we'll see how this. That's interesting, man. Let me. Let me. Yeah. Let's. <laughs> yeah. So this is a heads up, man. You know. But today you can see what's happening. We're going up in 53 million. We'll probably test it Monday or Tuesday. We go into the QQQs. That's going to be the same type of setup inside the QQQs. You know, we're already at the highs of the QQQs. Look at that. So yesterday, we went from a price point of that 384.71. It came down fast and furious, 65 million shares. Well, you're going, you have 384.01 oh right now. You went to 52. You're getting up there at 45 million versus 65 million. You know, that, the, the, the cues are the ones you really want to watch for basically some good signals, folks. Because the cues right now are weaker than the S&P. And the cues love to lead the market. The NDX 100 leads the market up, leads the market down, it drags it all over the place. That's, that's just how the cues in the NDX 100 works. You know, yeah, it's not like each and every day, but it's pretty close. And then, of course, put that together with the dollar. Dow. Dow Industrial is right now up 194. You get the Nasdaq up 278. S&P's up 46. There, right there, folks. You got our man, Mr. Larry Pesavento, coming up. Currencies, commodities, and bond markets are as important as ever right now with how they're driving the volatility in equity markets across the globe, which is why it's a great time to try out Teddy Kegstat's Tiger Forex Report. Teddy Kegstat breaks down the Forex markets every Monday using his 30-plus years of experience as a trading veteran of futures, Forex, stocks, and options. Teddy releases his weekly Tiger Forex Report every Monday morning with coverage of all the major currency pairs, including the dollar index, the euro dollar, pound dollar, dollar Swiss, dollar yen as well as many more and he also has weekly coverage of the crude oil market and the 30-year t-bonds as they both influence forex markets tremendously when you sign up for the tiger forex report you also gain instant access to teddy's 60-minute webinar archive he just hosted forex strategies and fundamentals what is behind the tiger forex report for all the details and to start your 30-day tiger forex report subscription today visit the front page of tfnn.com tfnn educating investors are you ready to take your trading to the next level? 
Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. Everything in the universe is governed by the Fibonacci sequence. This mathematical principle is responsible for everything from the most aesthetically pleasing artwork to patterns in the stock market. To stay on top of stock patterns you can take advantage of, sign up for the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter at TFNN.com. When you subscribe, you'll get a weekly report from veteran day trader Larry Pesavento on stocks you need to pay attention to. And you can trust Larry's analysis. After all, he's got 45 years experience as a day trader. Larry will also provide daily charts, videos, and data on the key markets that he's tracking. Expect notifications from Larry on market movement you need to act on at any time. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. Subscribe to the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter today. TFNN.com. Educating investors. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now trading up 190. We get the Nasdaq up 278. S&Ps are up 46. And we're going to come over to our man, Mr. Larry Pezzavento. And Larry, folks, has got a great treat for you. Coming this Wednesday, okay, August 2nd, from 9 to 2, it's going to be Larry Pezzavento live trading webinar. Uh, he does these a few times a year, folks, okay? They're amazing live trading webinars. So Larry is a patent recognition expert. And the bottom line is he's going to be out there showing you the different patterns and trading simultaneously. Now, what you get here is you get, you're going to get not only a great education, but you also get Larry's newsletter, Fibonacci 24-7. And you get that for a full month. And that is a value in itself of $97. The full workshop is $295. And that includes the $97 for the webinar and, and i mean for the the newsletter now on top of that happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear larry happy birthday to you thank you thomas i've had 83 of those songs sung to me over the years i love it <laughs> i love it yeah i can't, can't hardly tom i've been doing this for 60 years. Can you believe that? I started in 1959. How cool is and, that? Yeah, I know, and I, I love it just as much as the day I started. In fact, what I do on August the 2nd is my way of playing in the World Series because I get to demonstrate live, you know, what I do. And, you know, we don't, we've don't. we made money, luckily, in these leather four, but don't always, but we teach a lot while we're there. But these markets are so perfectly volatile that it, I just can't wait to do it. Because yeah, we're seeing it's, it's, it's kind of nice system. that the volatility is picking up again. Oh, yeah. my God. It's in spades. I mean, you look, today I was watching crude oil. It moved $4,000 up and down, 80 to 79, 79 to 80, 80 to 79, and 79 to, to 80. $4,000 wow. it did that. Yeah, amazing. Yeah, it's a pretty And you know what's so cool, Larry? And, it, you know, so in the context, folks, depending on how long you've been doing this, the difference is that, you know, years ago, you had to make up commissions. We don't even have to make up commissions anymore. Oh, so, I know. <laughs> and, and the spreads are tight. So it's a it's a whole yeah. different ball game, folks. Okay, you just yeah. got to basically, you know, the the probability game is there without a huge amount of fees, which is unbelievable, man. Oh, I mean, yeah. you know, it, it really we, is. It's we wild. used to pay. 
he used to pay sixty dollar round turn on a gold trade. Remember? Oh yeah, and you know, it's ridiculous. Now it's four dollars. Right, <laughs> and, and the spreads could be quarter half, and a quarter oh, half means, God, folks, yeah. you know, bottom line is that you know you're, you're talking about in, in an equity. Okay, you're talking about up to a dollar twenty-five. No, not a dollar. One hundred and twenty-five to two hundred and fifty or a thousand shares, and you know, yeah. you don't have to buy a thousand. But do you, do you remember the guy uh, Harvey Halkin? Harvey Halkin, I know. Yeah, like, the Osos Bandits. Yep. Yeah, this one that changed it all. They went to the Nasdaq and say, "Hey, we we're not going to do this anymore. You got to go down to decimals." And yeah. Well, sure well, enough, well, that's that's yeah. that's what uh, that's what put the 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 big fraud guy Madoff. That's what put him out of business. Mm -hmm. That's that was the essence of putting him out of business. That's how that worked, yeah. which is pretty wow. amazing. That's when he, you know, really stopped going south because the spreads got broken. You know, so wow. it's pretty wild. And then at that point, that's yeah. So I, this, there's a whole story behind that, Larry. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. It's oh it's yeah, insane. you knew those. You knew those people. So yeah. I did. I just heard yeah. about them because I wasn't in the. So talk school. to us about what you're going to be trading. And, well, and what you're going to be teaching out here. You know, you get your flashcards. Well, the main thing, the, the basis of everything I do is A B C D. I mean, that's yes. the structure of everything. But people don't look at it the same way. And I'm going to have to pick out seven or eight different uh, trading vehicles. I'm going to find the ones that are the easiest. Yeah. And I'm going to try to do one stock, but I'll do a foreign currency. I'll do gold, crude oil, the E-mini S&P, um, the Dow, uh, not the Dow Jones, maybe the Dow Jones, and then also uh, treasury bonds and uh, soybeans or wheat or corn. One of those, of those eight, we're going to have two or three really nice trades. Usually we do four trades a day. And in between the time that I'm trading, I'm going over the, the different trades. And the good part of it, Tom, is there's so many guys that have taken this class so many times that they chip in and say, hey, look at this one. And, you know, it really right. gives you a, a so really cool. warm feeling. They're seeing the same thing. And then so many times we just take those trades because they set up so perfectly. So, right. Now, and we now, got a let, lot of let's, materials. Let's talk, let's talk about your newsletter a bit, too, because they get they get a full month of your newsletter. And oh, yeah. When we're they, talking every, Fibonacci 24-7, yeah. folks, we are talking 24-7, <laughs> which is really cool. I make videos usually two or three a day, one before the market, one right after the market, and sometimes right in the middle of the day when uh, it shows you what we're looking for, why, how to put the trade on, where to put the stop. And we've done very well with those over the past uh, five or six years, and it's been been a lot of fun. But uh, it's easy for me to do it now because everything's set up automatically. All I got to do is record it, send it out, and uh, it, it's very helpful because it teaches as it goes. And that's uh, when you see it over and over again, yes. you finally get the drift. That, God, this stuff's not that hard. Right. You know, it, well, it's when really you send not. Them this is not also, calculus. Yeah. When you yeah. send them out, also, which is so cool, folks. Okay. So picture, picture. When you're dealing with patents, okay, and, and you know everything is triangles, folks. Everything is triangles in life, folks. By the way, okay. It sure is. And so when you see it, when Larry's doing these these uh, videos, it's so cool because it's not like you know it's not a it's a black and white deal, man. That's the real bottom line, okay. Hits yeah. this number, great. You're gonna buy it or sell it. Hits this number, you're gonna buy it or sell it, and. That makes things a lot easier, man. I mean, that's that's the bottom line. Do you know what I mean? It's like, and we, we're not saying we have a crystal ball because that's that's not the name of the game. But patent recognition is a big deal. And you know, if you're yep. a believer in triangles and math, you know, it, that, it makes it a lot easier. You know what I was watching last night, Larry? I was watching the um, the second Hubble uh, telescope that went up. Oh man! Yeah. If you have it, it's on Netflix, folks. It's amazing. It's just yeah, you like, have no idea what that universe is like. I mean, oh it's my just, God! It's so yeah, beautiful. It's, it's uh, unbelievable. It's unbelievable. Yeah, it's, we have a we have an astronomy lab here on Mount Hopkins. It's part of the astro. They have astronauts that train here at, at the University of Arizona, and they've got a big observatory there. And on, on nights uh, during the time when there's a new moon with no moon, yes, no full moon, they have a you can go there and set. And for seven or eight bucks, you have to go up to the top of the mountain on a bus, but you get to sit there for two hours and stare at the universe. And you're almost like you're in it. It's just like you were it, it, Well, floating. you know what's so it's cool? Just, I mean, you grew up on a farm, right? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Sure yeah. did. So you got to see the universe really well because, oh, you know. Yeah, we didn't have lights. <laughs> right. No, which is so cool, though, because <laughs> they, had, they had this woman that was an astrophysicist there. And they asked her, you know, how did you get involved in this? She says, well, they showed her growing up in this farm. She says, listen, we live in the middle of nowhere in Arkansas, right? But yet yeah. her education was phenomenal because, it's so, you know, she could see the universe like every night like in an extraordinary way.
you know so oh it just it's just incredible in fact down in the desert here you know we have areas where it's very dark yes and oh my gosh it's just incredible there it's just tom it's really funny that when sarah and i first got married we moved here we stayed at one of the cabins down at the, my buddy's ranch and there's no electricity we have little propane lamps you know okay and it was very dark and he had a skylight she said, oh my god she said what's that and she's the sky was so bright with stars in Hong Kong because it's you know smoggy yep. and stuff and there's so many skyscrapers you never got to see it. She had never seen an open sky with for millions of miles of you know the universe and she just never forgot that. So beautiful. She said, I, I, it's the first time I've ever seen the sky. How you know? cool is that? <laughs> yeah, it well, was. Listen, man. Happy birthday. You have a great weekend. Thank you. Safe Thank weekend. You. And folks, it's very easy to get this webinar. Come over to our website. You're going to see it right under featured content. You're going to have a blast. You're going to make money. And the bottom line, you're going to get a great newsletter. Larry, okay. have a great one and a safe one. God, God bless you, Tom. Tell Thank the family you. I said hello. See you Absolutely. later, Absolutely. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Attention traders. Larry Pesavento, the renowned trading mastermind, is holding an exclusive live trading event on Wednesday, August 2nd. From 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Eastern Time, transform your trading skills with the real-time wisdom of a Wall Street veteran. Just $295 gets you a front row seat to this power-packed session, plus a month free of Larry's sought-after newsletter, Fibonacci 24-7, a $97 value. Elevate your strategies, decode the markets, and achieve your financial goals. Remember, this event will be archived for all attendees, and Larry only does a few of these a year. Don't miss this opportunity. Sign up today at TFNN.com. Secure your future and start trading smarter. TFNN. Educating investors. The Gold Report. As a precious metal, gold is still king. It continues to hold the most effective safe haven and hedging properties across the global major trading hubs of the London OTC market, the U.S. futures market, and the Shanghai Gold Exchange. The Gold Report. Tom O'Brien publishes his weekly gold report every Monday morning for subscribers, consisting of coverage of the XAU, HUI, GDX, the dollar, bonds, the South African RAND, as well as 25 different mining equities with specific buy-sell recommendations. The Gold Report. New subscribers get a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. Subscribe to Tom O'Brien's Gold Report newsletter now at TFNN.com. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks, to Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 167, the Nasdaq's up 253, S&Ps are up uh, 40. Let's go inside the NDX 100 and take a look at what's moving this market today. So you got Lucent... Uh, is up 7.7, .7, the car maker. Now, check this out. This is really wild, man. There was an article yesterday and on Bloomberg, folks, right? So I haven't seen one of these cars, but I guess I could just jump on the web and take a look at it. But let's take a look here, okay, for a second. So here's what the story is, right? 
Each car that they are selling, they are losing $253,000 per car. Yeah, you heard that right. $253,000 per car. And I guess that's why I can see that right now that this quarter they plan on taking $185 million and losing $0.34 cents a share. And share price, they got, oh, my God, yeah, they got 2.2 billion shares out there, right? Yeah. Um, but is it, that's quite a number, right? <laughs> it's, it's like, like amazing, actually. I was really start thinking about it. It says, well, you know, maybe it's a decent car. Who knows? But, you know, anyway, Sirius Satellite, that's up 6.5%. Intel's up 6 Taken away from it, you got uh, uh, Walgreens is down 2.8%. Uh, Cisco's off one6 Charter Communications is off one5 Inside the Dow Industrials, the strength versus the weakness inside the Dow Industrials. You have the Microsoft is putting 51, 52 positive points, Boeing 29, Procter & Gamble 28. Taken away from it, you got United Health uh, minus 13, it's hardly nothing. Big Mac minus 10, uh, Goldman minus 9. Let's go to MCD and see this Big Mac deal. You know what's so crazy, folks, is that, you know, they, they came out with their numbers. Numbers were good yesterday. And... In Florida, what happens is that, you know, we, this is the home of Chick-fil-A, okay? And if you've never been to a Chick-fil-A, what happens is that, first off, that they're closed on Sundays. And per store, they take in a lot more than a McDonald's. And the lines are so big that they have traffic jams all the time. Well, as I'm coming to work this morning, I'm going by a um, McDonald's. And it's the first time I ever seen the line literally out on the street, meaning, and blocking traffic like a Chick-fil-A. It was like, whoa, man, I don't know if they got a new special that's going on or what. Now, that being said, take a look at this chart, because this is the type of chart that wants to break out. See, this, see, the, see the volume characteristic here to, today? You've, you've gone sideways for about 13 weeks. This is heavy volume going up. You get volume of 15 of 13 million. Last time you were up here was nine. Time before that was 10. 13 is a big number. Now let me put this on the monthly. Monthly is kind of just steady. But bottom line, that looks to me like you're going higher. And they just did Let's see. And you got to remember something that, you know, they're, they're also a real estate company. <laughs> 6.5 billion, 297th at the bottom line. Now, their growth is not big. 2% in the U.S. per year, 2.5% internationally. That's about it. But bottom line is that uh, they're making money hand over fist. And then, of course, you heard Tommy talking about Chipotle this morning. The amazing part is that they you know, owned, you know, 90% of Chipotle. And if they ever, imagine if they ever owned both of them, there was a, there was a conflict because Chipotle, of course, is a, you know, they push the aspect of um, fresh food. And so I think, I think one of the, I think that's what ended up happening. I, I'm not sure what happened, but I can picture that, you know, you get the fresh food on one side, you get McDonald's on the other side. So, okay, what do we do? But bottom line is that you can see, you know, they, they basically are pushing out food, man. The GDX. Let's see where we're going to go with the gold contract here, the gold market here. So the GDX, yeah, this wants to get tested again. See? It, it, now, we, we, we filled the gap. That being said, well, let's see. We filled the gap with what? 28, now 38 million shares versus 44. Close call, man. Because of the gold contract, my take is that we're going to come down there one more time. That's what it looks like to me. Um, you know, you can see you're up today in 13 million. Yeah, one of our tigers is saying that his grandson manages a Chick-fil-A. Check this out, 11 million per year they take in. That's just one store in six days a week. It's, and if you ever go to one, now I've, I, I, I actually don't eat meat anymore at all. Um, but when I did, 
um, you know, when you have parties, they have these uh, Chick-fil-A balls or something. I don't know, chicken balls. They, um, they, it's like eating crack, folks. I don't know what crack is, but you know what I'm saying? You can't eat one. <laughs> they the chicken inside like little balls, and they come with the, you know, the, the catering part. It, they're insane. They're like, you just can't eat one, and people go out of their mind on them. And I, I can see why. Anyway, so let's go next to, let's go to Valley, because this is going to get interesting here. So you hear about the Saudis going everywhere, right? Well, they're doing a deal now. It's going to get interesting. Uh, nuggets, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Sounds a lot better. Yeah, exactly. Um, so we take a look at this. Let's see what this has to say. So Canada vowed to curb foreign investment in critical minerals. Sector will face first major test of Saudi Arabia deal to buy into some of the country's largest nickel mines. Trudeau introduced new rules in October that added a layer, layer of regulatory scrutiny into investors from foreign entities. And I guess this uh, valley announced uh, Thursday that Saudi Arabia Public Investment Fund and Saudi Arabia Mining Company agreed to buy a joint 10% stake in the Brazilian mining company Base Metals Unit. Valley operates Canada's largest nickel mine in Labrador and operations in Sudbury, Ontario. Yeah, well, Canada's approval process could involve national security review that can take 200 days or more and then require a sign off from the Canada. Lawmakers, yeah, they're kind of uh, everywhere these days. That's what that's uh, kind of kind of getting into. Let's see, BTH, BTH. What do we have here? Okay, body light. No, huh. BTC. Thank you, BTC. Nope. Oh, Bitcoin, Bitcoin. Oh. So if we take a look at Bitcoin, they trade in 29,000. Put this on up. Well, this has a little more to go to ice. Ice is laying out at 33,000. There's ice right there. That's kind of ice. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. If you're looking for potential trading setups in the stock market, then Rocket Equities and Options Report is a newsletter you should try. Tommy O'Brien delivers options and equity trades when the markets present them using a combination of fundamentals and technicals. Sign up for Rocket Equities and Options Report today with a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. For all the details and to start your subscription today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Biotech is booming, but for how long? Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. 
Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. TFNN has launched the Tiger's Den, hosted at Discord. TFNN has been educating traders for more than 20 years with live programming hosted by a variety of professional traders during market hours. The Tiger's Den, available to all tigers and tigresses for just $1 for the year. There's no catch or added costs when you join our community of traders. Sign up today and become a part of this educational community of traders. Just visit the front page of TFNN.com. This program is brought to you by Vista Gold, traded on the NYSE American and TSX under the symbol VGZ. I'm O'Brien. Welcome back, folks. The Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 169, and NASDAQ up 257. S&Ps are up uh, 40. And I'm going to go back to Bitcoin just for a second because the Tiger wants to know if it doesn't hold here where it would go. So let's take a look here. Well, this is, you know, we don't have volume on these things, but this is, this would be just like a, an equity. See these big bars here? In fact, I should ask Larry about those big bars on the dollar. When you see big bars like this, is that just a normal retracement brings you down back to the bottom of the bar. And that's uh, 20, 28,169. Here, 29,295. And um, let me see something. BTN. No. GBTC, GBTC, GBTC. One second. Yeah, this is going to get interesting. Now let's look at this, okay? So right now, folks, let's see what this. I'm I'm going to the Grayscale Trust. So the Grayscale Trust. This is the Bitcoin Trust. They're still trading at a minus twenty eight percent premium what that specifically means now so now this trust okay just to get things straight here the only thing they invest in is a hundred percent of bitcoin now watch if i put the holdings up you're going to see it you know it's a hundred percent period that's what they hold they hold bitcoin but yet they trade at a 20 percent 28 percent discount still now there's a court case that's going on and there's going to be a lot more court, court cases against the SEC because the, the once the can of worms is kind of opened, the SEC has, has lost a couple of big cases. Um, and, you know, we'll see where this baby shakes out. But the closer that this gets, um, you know, we'll see whether they win. Now, the probabilities are at this point that they still won't. But if they do, you are going to see that close immediately that 28 percent negative premium because of the fact then then there'll be a pure etf under a different security law the thing that's so intriguing about these etfs versus this is a trust that's the difference see that see where it says grant of trust incorporated in delaware well the grant of trust is under a different rule than the ETFs, and that's why you can see that the ETFs themselves, and even Bitcoin, can trade in the futures. There's, there's different rules and regulations. The bottom line, we'll see where it shakes out. What is going to happen, though, well, what's happening right now is this. Because of digital assets, the SEC and Gary Gensler and this is the way that any this is the way that any good either corporation or someone going against the corporation is kind of set up. And what it is is this is that if you take a shot, meaning that 
what, what the SEC has done, so the, the beef on the folks that have, whether it's the tokens, or the bitcoins, or the stable coins, is that the SEC won't give them enough guidance, okay? The SEC is basically saying, no, we have all that, okay? What, without basically saying, okay, show me where inside the regulations that you basically can regulate us. Well, when you're always, if, you, if you're gonna get in a brawl, the easiest way to do that, meaning a legal brawl, is that you have these things that you don't want to basically get a ruling on. Because once you get a ruling on it, then you either win or lose. So most of the time what ends up happening is that in the SEC's case, everyone else will back down. Now what has happened in the last two or three years is that big companies, big hedge funds, they're not backing down anymore. And what does happen is the SEC, if the SEC you know, is coming after them, they'll come after them for years. But what has happened is that all of these large funds have got a lot bigger also, and they're saying, you know what, we're gonna go after them. We're gonna say that no, you don't have the authority in order to basically regulate it because you're trying to regulate something that inside the regulation is not there. So we're gonna get a lot of different cases and we'll find out you know, what, what is gonna be regulated, what is not gonna be regulated. And um, what I still can't figure out <laughs> is this whole thing about the uh, stable coins of how a stable coin can actually pay any type of interest at all. Because it's like, well, what does it do? Where is it making the money to pay interest? That's what, you know, that, that's what it seems to always come down to. We'll, we'll find out how this whole thing goes. But you can expect court cases for years, folks. I mean years. Yeah. And what's going to be intriguing, now, the court case is different. The, the ones I'm talking about is as to, you know, what these are, are totally different than Bankman Freed. Bankman Freed is just a ripoff. He should be in jail for freaking ever. And he's going to jail. They, they're going to get him in a monster way. And he's going, that case is going up uh, in October. That's a whole different ballgame. You know, you take someone's money, you know, you rip them off, you, you, you know, buy something you're not supposed to buy. That, that's a whole different ballgame. But we'll see what a jury does with that. Let's go to the note and bond market. Because the note and bond market, yesterday we took down, we, we came down hard in the note and bond market yesterday. So if we go to the 10 year first, Okay, so you're at the bottom of the range. Yeah, well, see, this is good, though. Notes and bonds still want higher price, man. Yesterday, what happened is this. Yesterday, we came down with 2.2 million contracts in the 10, but guess what? This is how, this is how we, you know, we, we actually, we, we were going into, here, let me do this. Because we were also going to the lows that had 2.2, so we did 2.2. And then what ended up happening today is today you go lower. You rejected lower price at 110.25, and now you're at a 111.12. You know, if you're looking for, you know, how do you reject lower price, to have light of volume, that's it right there. And you're still inside the range. Look at this. It went right to the bottom of the range, though. Look at this. <laughs> Almost to the tick. And to the tick, I'm talking about four months ago, three months ago. You know, and uh, so if we do the 30, you want to say, see what this looks like. 30 did the same thing. Today you get 395,000 contracts. You got to a lower low, you rejected lower price. That was coming into 385. You did 476 yesterday. You got under it today with 359. You rejected lower price. They're both going higher, you know. So the Fed could do whatever. Well, we'll find out how this goes. But that you know, the Fed we're at five to five and a half percent. The, the market and notes and bonds still want to go to higher price, lower yield. Dow Dow Industrials right now up 158. You get the Nasdaq up 253. S&P's up 39. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.
Are you ready to take your trading to the next level? Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Everything in the universe is governed by the Fibonacci sequence. This mathematical principle is responsible for everything from the most aesthetically pleasing artwork to patterns in the stock market. To stay on top of stock patterns you can take advantage of, sign up for the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter at TFNN.com. When you subscribe, you'll get a weekly report from veteran day trader Larry Pesavento on stocks you need to pay attention to. And you can trust Larry's analysis. After all, he's got 45 years experience as a day trader. Larry will also provide daily charts, videos, and data on the key markets that he's tracking. Expect notifications from Larry on market movement you need to act on at any time. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. Subscribe to the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter today. TFNN.com. Educating investors forget you can listen to tfnn live on your mobile device 24 hours per day go to tfnn.com then hit watch tiger tv that's tfnn.com then hit watch tiger tv welcome back folks to dow dow is up 194 nasdaq's up 269 s&p's up 45 so old republic ori now take a look at this uh yeah this is a breakout uh put this on even a 10-year monthly and you're going to see it's a, you know, it's an, this is an insurance company, folks, okay? It's an ABC up. You know, bottom line is taking it out, taking it out with volume. You get uh, 20, it's about a 6.8 A to B off of the low, which would be about 30. It's going after 30 bucks. That's how, that's how it looks to me right now. Let's see if there's another high up there from long. No, yeah, there's no, not another high. They're in the insurance business, but yeah, that's real. That's, has the price, has the volume, has all of the above. Uh, so if we take a look at uh, how we're going to finish out here, what you're going to have is this. You said you come down with heavy volume yesterday. You're going to be up with light volume today, but these highs are going to be tested because they're high volume highs. So bottom line, you know, the, the SPY right now, the high yesterday was at 459. You're right next to it. We're at 456 right now inside the queues now the queues never made the high so it's going to be really cool watching the high, watching the queues because the queues are weaker than the spy right now so the queues they might have already did it let me see this that's 71 three no we went okay so today went to 384.52 384.71 was the high of yesterday the actual high is 387.98 and uh, the, the queues actually have more volume than the spy yeah and that more volume meaning that it's dramatically not that different. Meaning, yeah, we, we did 65 million yesterday, doing 51 today, that's not bad. 
The high out there is 54. You're probably going to hit it. So you can expect the test of those highs. That's the bottom line. So you get the test with lighter volume. You know how you get a volume and price. If you either you're going to make it or break it, that's that's how these things shake out, man. There's, there's, that's how it just how it goes. No no two ways about that. Where whoa, one second. I just do that. There we go. Always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God, there's always another trade. Health, happiness, and prosperity. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Come back and visit uh, Tommy Monday morning. Don't forget about Larry's workshop. It's going to be a great workshop coming up this Wednesday. Check it out on the front page of TFNN. Have a great weekend, folks, and a safe weekend. Look at him, folks.